it is perfect weekend weather. So that's really what we like to see. Even warmer, it looks like, by tomorrow. Let's check in with our weather watcher, shall we? Always keeping an eye on things for us. So this is our friend Dave. Solid sunshine, Dave. We love to see that. This is in Centerville, Maryland. 83 degrees as of just about an hour ago. So, Dave, we appreciate that. Enjoy your Sunday evening. Temperature. So, I mentioned earlier, Baltimore, the high today was 83 degrees. So, we are certainly running about five degrees below what we consider normal for this time of year, really across the state. Frederick, you're at 82. Westminster, you're at 85. Annapolis, 83. Easton, 81. And the dew points, yes, they are in the 50. So that air out there, it's pretty dry. You are not battling a lot of humidity. You're also not battling any storms, really any clouds for that matter. We're tracking solid sunshine and quiet weather. And you can see just how quiet we are on the radar and satellite. It looks like our next chance for storms doesn't arrive until Tuesday night. So we'll take a look at that. But did want to talk about here the tropics. So we do have just the remnants right now moving towards the Leeward Islands of what was a hurricane, then a tropical storm. So we're not going to see uh, many updates on that. We also, though, are keeping our eye on what is now Tropical Storm Chris. Now, the good news with Chris is it is going to stay well offshore of the United States, so not going to have any effect on Maryland. You can see it's actually expected to move south, becoming a Category 1 hurricane before eventually tracking northeast, regardless, though, staying well away from the United States. So that's what we like to see. Let's take a look at the future cast. So we'll jump it to tonight at midnight. At that point, high pressure still really in control, and you can see how quiet we are. We stay quiet throughout the day Monday. For the most part, Monday, we're talking solid sunshine. The most we can expect would be a few clouds. Here we are Tuesday, and I mentioned that chance for rain. So it seems to be in the late evening hours when we're going to see some of that rain move through. At this point, doesn't look particularly heavy. We're not expecting severe storms at this point. Of course, that's something we'll be keeping an eye on. And then we dry out for the rest of the work week. If you did have plans to take the boat out, south winds tomorrow right around 5 knots, so pretty quiet out there. As for temperatures tonight, so keep in mind what we consider normal for this time of year, upper 60s, but oh no, we are going to be down into the upper 50s, so kind of a cool night, cool at least for this time of year. And then tomorrow, we're bypassing the low 80s and we're actually jumping back up into the upper 80s, so temperatures kind of returning to normal for tomorrow, and then it seems by Tuesday, jumping up to the low 90s. Now remember we have that cold front move through. It's not going to bring us cold air, but cooler it looks like because we wrap up the work week once again in the upper 80s with pretty solid doses of sunshine there, just a few clouds. So 